us to open fire. Copy that. Stay on course while we escort you in. You stay on the straight and narrow. If it weren't for the wall, friend, I gotta confess, I'm not much in the mood for conversation. I know I shouldn't let that woman get up under my skin, but well, I can't seem to help it. Well, then you got about as much of sense as she does. Look, this ain't New Atlantis, it ain't all flowers and chirping birds out there. These walls around us, they're here for a damn good reason. I've trained the guards here for years, again, for a damn good reason. We get it wrong, we not watching all the time, then the ash to kill innocent people. That's the simple reality of the situation. So when someone struts into town with their untested ideas on how to do things better than those of us who dedicated our lives to protecting the city, that don't go over so well. This ain't help. This is thinking you know better than the people that have done it for years, decades even. It's just arrogance. <sighs> Look, this is getting my blood pressure up talking about this so damn much. You think you can talk some sense into her? Be my guest. Otherwise, I suggest you leave defending this city to the people who spent their lives doing it. We need to be smarter, better in the way we handle the ash stuff. Well, you sure don't look like you're delivering the capacitors I'm waiting for. Something I can do for you? No, you misunderstand, I think. I placed the order last week. I'm just waiting for it to actually show up. So, did you need something, or...? Uh, no. That's not really accurate. It is, however, slightly less openly hostile a reaction than I've gotten around here, so I'll take it. I'm not sure what you've heard, or quite frankly, why this seems to be getting around the way it is. Despite assertions to the contrary, I'm not attempting to run anyone out of a job, or open the city gates to allow Ashton to come pouring in. Nor am I in any way attempting to make a statement about the competence of the current security forces and or apparatus in Aquila City. I hope that clears things up. Are you? Huh. That's refreshing. I just... I need to prove that what I'm working on can make a positive difference. Then you'll see it my way. I could really use some help, in fact. Just to make sure this all goes off without a hitch. Would you be willing to place some sensors for me? That is great news. Just take these and stick them in specific spots in the city along the wall. When you're done, come find me. I'll find something to do in the meantime to give myself an air of plausible deniability. City's really the heart of the Free Star Collective.
missed that key. You're in the Vanguard, right? Hey. You got some good news, I hope? Well, that's that then. So, this next part, it's a bit delicate. See that guard tower across the way there? I need to get in there and make a few small modifications to the terminal inside. I don't have the processing power to collate all the data that'll be coming in from the sensors. The existing network does. Oh, goodness. I really am bad at communicating sometimes. I have that part well in hand. The... Uh, guard, standing outside there, he's not gonna let me in. I need you to distract him. I should only need a few moments. So, I, I don't know, convince him to take a break or something. Or, if you're feeling particularly rebellious, maybe give him some official business to attend to. I believe it's what Davis would refer to as a ruckus. As soon as you've got him occupied, I'll scoot in and out before anyone notices. Okay? Let's do this. You have a nice day now. Be careful if you run into those ecliptic jerks. They fly around like they own the settled systems. And they like to use old abandoned facilities as outposts. You know, the ones left over from the colony war? What brings you to the wall? Boredom. Because if that's what you're looking for, you've hit the jackpot. And I'm just supposed to take this on what? Faith? This isn't getting us anywhere. I'm starting to think you're trying to get away with something. Yeah, I hope so. Yeah, yeah, I remember now. I'm trying to be reasonable here. I... I guess I believe you. Just don't do anything I'll regret, okay? That's all settled then. Thanks for the assist. Hope you're none too worse for wear. is bending the rules, not breaking laws, and it'll all work out in the end. You'll see. Once enough data has been collected, I'll have the proof I need to convince them, especially Davis, that my technology is useful. If you're curious, come back tomorrow. I might even have preliminary findings. Heard of the Elios retreat? It's supposed to be some new age healing center. The sensors shouldn't cause any disruption at all. I checked the schematic three times. Oh, it's you. I got the data from the seismic sensors, and I, I, I need help. Nothing that would get you in trouble this time. Promise. I need someone to go talk to Davis Wilson. He isn't speaking to me. None of the security folks are, actually. Oh, thank you. It's really nice to hear that when others just don't seem to care. 
Remember the sensors you helped me set up around the city? Well, Davis Wilson is pretty angry about it. I suppose I should have expected that, but now no one involved with security is willing to talk to me. At all. And I really need to coordinate with them because the data I'm getting from the sensors is... Well, it's off. Not what I expected at all. Well, the thought has crossed my mind that maybe they have things a little too under control. Look, I know I screwed up here. I went behind Davis's back and did what he told me not to. I don't expect him to talk to me. But this? I'm not gonna lie. It looks an awful lot like someone has been purposely messing with the system. I can't just stroll up and accuse him of anything, but maybe someone, you I'm thinking, could just ask around, see if something is going on. I'd really appreciate it. Here think we own Akila. They're wrong. The Ashta do. Don't mean to be rude, but I got a lot of things on my plate right now. So unless this is important, I'm gonna have to ask you to come back some other time. Oh, did you now? And did that perhaps come from a certain entitled so-called inventor who's caused me no end of headaches? Right, of course you are. Well then, concerned citizen, there have been some unpleasant developments of late. I'm not gonna name names, but you and I both know damn well who to thank. She made my life a lot more difficult, but I don't have time to deal with that right now. I have more important things to worry about. Been tracking Ashta for a long time now, and suddenly their behavior doesn't add up. Probably not a coincidence. Her help is likely what put us in this mess. I think I'll pass. Now I need to get back out there and get some eyes on this situation. Since you so interested, looks like you can handle yourself. You wanna join me? <laughs> yeah, I've heard more than a few hunters say something similar. They nearly all apologize for it later. Gear yourself up however you need to and meet me at the gate. We'll head out from there. My mother wanted me to be a doctor. A doctor. <laughs> Mothers. All right. Give me some time to get to the gates. I ain't as nimble as I used to be. All right, you ready to head out there? Okay then, just stick close to me, keep your head on a swivel and you'll be fine. We'll be back before you know it. And maybe we'll get some answers. I know your type, a freewheeling space ace. Must be nice. They're all wrong. The space and the depth just doesn't make any sense. Let's keep going.
The Ashta are clever, but they're usually predictable. These tracks don't follow any other paths I expect them to. It just doesn't add up. Looks like the tracks head this way. the wall is no day trip. You know how to handle yourself. Most times someone encounters an ash that they panic. Not you. But now I got even more questions. Who in the hell did this and why? No, I expect not. Someone from Aquila Security did this. We're the only ones that have access to these robots or can change their orders. I need to check this over, see if I can find some more details. But while I do that, I need you to run back to the city. Check the access logs on the computer in the barracks. Look for whoever signed for this thing last. I'll meet you in the city when I'm done here. joke. Say those <laughs> No idea what we do to keep them safe. If it weren't for the walls, the whole town would be an Ashta buffet. People have no idea what we do to keep them safe. Oh, hey there. Back already. Davis said something about you going on patrol with him? He's... <clears throat> he's alright, isn't he? Nothing, uh, bad happened out there. 
What's that supposed to mean? <sighs> I thought I deleted the logs. Look, people getting hurt was never part of it. Davis has just been so stressed over this whole thing with that woman and her sensors, and it's been affecting him on the job. The damn robot was just supposed to stomp around, mess up her data, and then come back. I didn't know it would rile up the Ashta so much, and it wasn't supposed to break down. It won't matter. I really screwed this up. We need to get to the bottom of it. The robot's internals are fried, so I came up empty. You have any better luck than I did? Know who's responsible? You serious? Oh, Bailey, what were you thinking? My own people sabotaging equipment. Whole world's gone crazy. Well, I'm out to go deal with this. Thanks for helping out. I'll kick some credits your way. May not be much, but not made of money around here. You might want to give Miss Alpin some time to get clean data. Might be a research. Well, it might prove useful. <laughs> 